Hey guys and welcome back to a new video on this channel, I'm Sabi from Code Revolution. So today I am showing you a new feature of the AIMatic plugin which will allow you to quickly teach its basic stuff about you, about your products, about your business or about anything else and it will be always able to respond in a precise way like this based on additional info you want to add to the AI. So for example if you want to teach about uh, teach the AI about your business this is the best way so the embeddings feature was added in the latest version of AImatic and let me show you how to use it so first of all we need to go to the main settings of the plugin because if we go directly to the AI embeddings page you will see a message that you need to add a pine cone dot io api key so because of this we go to api keys in the main settings menu of the plugin and we will need to add a pinecone dot io api key so for this click here sign up for a pinecone dot io api key enter your api key here afterwards you will need to go to embeddings and enter your pinecone index here so the pinecone index is similar to this and you will see it on your pinecone account if you do have trouble finding it simply search for tutorials on how to search for your pinecone index you will find it okay so after the index is added and also your api key is saved here in the pinecone api key be sure to check also the checkboxes where you want to enable the index the embeddings feature so if you want to enable the embeddings feature only in the chat leave only the chat shortcodes checkbox checked and save settings okay now we will be able to go to ai embeddings and first of all i recommend that you uh, check this tutorial and also watch the video that is actually this video which will be also added here and also read the basic information about embeddings here and now we can proceed and start creating our own embeddings and uh, let me show you how to do this so for example let me go to ai playground and let's check a basic um, question so who is jonas let's ask the ai a basic question who is jonas and it should not be able to respond to this question because it has it does not have any information about this person or even better it might respond with a random yeah so it responds with a random uh, string so jonas is a fictional character yeah okay so it found a jonas character and it said that hey jonas is him okay but now let me show you how to teach the ai about how to um about who is jonas and use embeddings with for this so for example let's write here in the add a new embedding jonas is a time traveler he is very smart click save and you will see a message embedding saved and if we go to list edit embeddings and click sync embeddings you will see jonas is a time travel he's very smart you can delete or manage if you click manage you will be able to edit the content of the embeddings here okay so if you want to delete it you can do it here and we will be able to check now so let's refresh this page to not uh, get the wrong information to the ai and now ask him once again who is jonas and now because we added the embeddings feature and traveling through time to search their town form disaster so as you can see traveling through time the ai already got that he is a time traveler 
Now let me add um, some other info. I am uh, so let me my laptop is new and uh, it was bought from an online store okay so just some generic information and if we sync embeddings we will see that my laptop is here listed and if we try to ask the ai how is my laptop okay let's see what we will get now your laptop is new and sounds like what was a good purchase congratulations so yeah this is simply how you can use embeddings and uh, for example if we go ahead and delete this embedding and we will see that hey the embedding was deleted and let's ask again the ai that who is Jonas so now it should not be able to know that he's a time traveler but it should get some random yeah so the giver yeah it's no time traveler here and if we re-add this we will see that so let's rick is a news agency encore okay and let me ask him about rick now who is rick and we should see that he's a news agency okay so something rick is a news agency anchor let's try this again so who is rick let's see that this time it will work news agency anchor so this time it worked as it might take a couple of seconds for the embeddings to function so news agency anchor so if you want to be more specific i recommend that you make more specific embeddings and yeah this is how you will be able to use this new feature in aiomatic and keep in mind that you will be able to set this to be active on chat on content editing single post creator the bulk post ai creator and completion shortcodes editing shortcodes and even related questions creations from the bulk ai creator uh, feature so go ahead guys check aiomatic it is linked in this video description and let me know what you think about this new embedding feature and uh yeah it should be really a help helping you guys out in many ways as uh, usually you don't want to create a model training and fine tuning for some specific things that you want to add to the ai so it will be kn knowing more info about you or your products or your company so yeah this is all for today let me know what you think about this new feature and i will be reading the comments so leave a comment below like share subscribe it's really appreciated and until next time i will be going back to work now to add more features to aomatic link below thanks for watching until then bye bye